Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I did this super easy look using a red lipstick. So if you want to see how I did this makeup look, please keep on watching. I'm using the Luminous Silk Foundation from Georgia Armani with the Sigma F80 brush. I will be using the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. Before going in with the beauty blender, I let the concealer sink in a little bit so it doesn't crease. Then I will be using the Soleil Tan de Chanel with the Sigma F80 brush. I love this bronzer, especially that I'm super light at the moment. So it gives a little bit um, of color to my, to my face. I also go with the Soleil Tan de Chanel on the side of my nose. I will go again with the Beauty Blender. All over my face to blend everything in together. I will then take the Laura Mercier translucent powder with a sponge, a triangle sponge. I will take up a lot of product. And go over the concealer. face is baking, I will be setting my uh, lid with the Makeup Forever uh, setting powder in the number 113. Then for the eyeshadow, I will be using the palette uh, Madame Renaissance from Anastasia Beverly Hills. I will be using the color Burnt Orange with the uh, Lise the Finishing Brush. And it's super pigmented. After applying the first eyeshadow, which is burnt orange, I just go like blend, blend, blend. I, I blend very well, so there is no harsh line. Then the second color I will be using is the raw sienna with the same brush. Just lower. Then I will take my MAC 272 with the color Primavera and go, go all over the lid. the MAC 217 brush on the outer crease. And I bring it like to the front. And then I will take a brush with nothing and blend everything. I will take my Real 
Technique brush. It's the contour brush and I will buff everything. powder in medium dark with my Makeup Forever brush in 270. I will mix both color. I go in the same direction as the, the hair goes. And the front it goes upwards, so I go upward I follow the hair direction. Then for the brow one, I will be using the tempera with the um, eyeshadow brush from Lizotti. Then I take a brush with nothing on it and I blend it down. Then for the bronzing powder, I will be using the Excellent Terre Salient with the MAC 168 brush. I go over wherever I apply the Soleil Tan de Jean. The side of my nose with the, the random brush, I have no number on it, so. I blend everything. Then I will be using the Real Technique buffing brush with um, nothing on it. Buff everything together. So there is the harsh line. Then on top of the previous bronzer, I will be applying a little bit of uh, the uh, Max Solar Rich. Then I will be using the uh, NARS Orgasm Blush with the Seneca Shook brush. I will write the number of it in the description box because I don't know which uh, brush it is. Just a little bit, not too much. Then to highlight, I will be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit uh, with in the shade bubbly with my Morphe M501. Then with the pencil brush the 290 from MAC, I would be doing my Cupid's bow. And then I will be taking the shade Sunburst with the pencil brush, the 219, and I will go in my tear duct. I'll be taking the 212 from MAC with the uh, Anastasia Burnt Orange, and I will go on my lower lid. I will be using the Ross Sienna. Then I will be curling my lashes with my Tarte Lash Curler. Then I will be using the L'Oreal Voluminous Luginal Mascara. I'm now gonna wear uh, false lashes that will be putting a lot of layers. Then I also go on my lower lashes. Then for my lips, I will be using the uh, Brick Lip Liner. I 
co to toaletka. The terrorist any mistake I have made, I take my uh, MAC brush, the 242, and I go with my um, little bit of foundation wherever I made a mistake. Then I take my MAC uh, Cindy lipstick. Then to finish up the look, I will be using the MAC Fix Plus all over my face. So remove all the powdery effects. Thank you for watching and if you liked the video, please like and subscribe. See you on my next video.